Hello guys, welcome back to Chasing Infinity. This is Adarsh and in this video we'll see how you can do linear regression in just two minutes, okay? So I'll set two minutes on the clock and let's go. So let's start by making some imports. We'll need NumPy. So import NumPy as NP. Then we'll need matplotlib to visualize the results. Then we'll need pandas to get or import the data set. And finally, from sklearn.linear model, import linear regression. We'll be using this module to perform the linear regression. So if you don't have sklearn, you can uh, install it by using pip. Just do pip install uh, scikit-learn. So now let's perform the linear regression. Let's load our data set first. So this is how our data set looks like. The first column is the independent variables or the x values. And the second column is the dependent variable or y values. And we will be predicting these set of values. Okay. So this means get all the rows from the column with index 0 or the first column. Dot values is used to convert the data set into a numpy array and then we are reshaping that array. Here the minus 1 means that it will automatically calculate the dimensions of the rows and 1 means that the, all the columns should have the di a dimension of 1. Similarly get the values of y into the variable y. Now let's create a regression object. I'll call it lr. Now to perform the linear regression, all we have to do is call the fit method. Now let's make the predictions for y. So if you have some more testing data, then you can pass that into the predict function. Here I am just passing in the x values. Okay, now let's execute this. Okay, now let's uh, visualize the results. Let's execute this. And there you go. So we have the blue dots that was our input data set. Okay, the, the x and y values. And the red line is our regression line. So this line is at the least distance from each and every point on this on this plot. So if you want, you can check out the written version of this tutorial on Medium. You can also check out my GitHub repository. I'll leave the links in the description. So thank you so much for watching this video. And if you learned something new from this today, please do leave a like and subscribe to my channel. And also if you have any problems or doubts, please do leave them in the comments or you can email me. I'll leave it in the description and I'll see you in the next one.